Love feeding your friends? If by feeding, you actually mean pranking, then you've come to the right place. We've got a ton of awesome food-related pranks for you to play. Watch and enjoy. Looks like Natalie is being a good friend and made some muffins for her and Zoe. Nah, that's too easy. I know, let's spice things up a bit. Grab some wasabi and decorate your muffins. The more generous you are with your delicious green frosting, the more grateful your friend will be. So don't skimp. Make sure you do the same to the one you actually plan to eat. Otherwise, your friend may get suspicious. Sprinkle some edible pearls on top. We don't want to send anyone to the hospital. And our muffins are ready. I made muffins, and one's got your name on it. I think it's this one. Mmm, that's so bad. What is that? My mouth's on fire. I need water. While Zoe's putting out that fire, I'm just gonna enjoy my muffin in peace. Who's awesome? I'm awesome. Ah, uh, the old gummy brains. But I just don't get that same kick off of them anymore. Maybe I can repurpose them somehow. But mm. what's the angle here? Think, Zoe. Think. I've got it. Grab your brains, or whatever other unsavory gummies you've got, and place them in an ice tray. Looks like there's an extra one. Mouth to the rescue. Mmm. Pour in some water with food coloring. We went with blue, but you can use whatever. And we're half done. Throw the tray in the freezer, and voila! Our special icy treat is ready to go in a glass of water. Give it a stir, and we're good to go. <laughs> Natalie, darling, care for a drink? Aw, thanks, Zoe. That's so sweet. I'll just give it a little stir. Are those brains? I'm gonna be sick. I love how we're all sharing lunch. Try the fries. Told ya. Amazing, right? Sure, Ashley. Don't have to ask me twice. Oh, it's like an explosion of deliciousness in my mouth. Now you. No, me. Ben always has to be the center of attention, even during lunch. That's okay, though, because I know just what to do to take him down a notch. <laughs> You've probably got everything you need for this prank. Stick a straw in your saucer ketchup and hide it in the cup. Try the cola, Ben. Ugh, why is it so sour? Sometimes giving your friends something to chew on is the only way of getting them to shut up. Hi guys, I've got a very special burger recipe for you. Okay, so there's nothing odd about the beginning of this recipe. Grab some ketchup. Generously spread it on the bun. Throw some lettuce on top a little cheese, a slice of tomato. But here's where we finally go off the beaten path and fashion our chocolate bar into a meat patty. Cover it up. Salt, pepper, and other condiments to taste. And our burger special is ready. Now it's just a matter of time. Hey there, Zoe. Who's not hungry when they get back from school? Hmm, no patty in that bite. What in the world? Who the hell pairs chocolate with cheese and lettuce? What? Yuck! What a waste of food! Come out, come out, wherever you are. There we go. 
my sweet eyeball gummies. Ew. Let's put you to good use and scare the daylights out of Natalie. When making ramen for your friend, don't forget to season it for them as well. I hope Natalie's been practicing her staring contest technique. Yeah! Here you go, friend. I think we all know who won that round. Meat eaters are definitely not going to be enticed by this one. That vegetarian in your life, though. Cut and de-seed your cucumber. And fill it with sprinkles. The more, the merrier. Use toothpicks to secure the leftover cucumber tip. And voila! Our veggie special's ready. Now, camo that cucumber. Looks like Zoe's ready for her low-cal meal. Doesn't mm -hmm. that cuke look good? Mmm, what's a salad without cucumbers? That's weird. I've never seen this type of cuke before. Those are some festive seeds? Well, I'm always down to try new things. I consider myself a food explorer. Huh? Hey guys, what does spaghetti remind you of? Grab an old basting brush and free it from any remaining bristles. Make some dough using water and flour and mix it up real well. Spray some oil on the brush, stick on the flour, and some spaghetti. Nice. What is this? Huh? My new brush, Natalie. Let's boil it and see if it's edible. Hello, Zoe. What are you watching? Oh, I think I've seen this episode. Careful, don't spill. Oh. Ew, something's wrong with my soda. Can I try yours? I see. Another prank, huh? I'll get you back soon enough. For this one, you'll need a soda can. Make a hole in the bottom. And pour out the soda. Have a quick drink. And grab some soy sauce. Pour it in a small container. Looks like the coast is clear. Suction up that soy sauce. Whoa, Natalie, I didn't know you wanted to be a nurse. All right, all right, just inject the can. And use a glue gun to cover up those holes in the bottom. Hey guys, what you playing? Natalie, you're going first. The rules are simple. One of the 10 eggs is raw. The others are all boiled. Yeah! Uh -huh. Ben's turn. It's like a less dangerous version of Russian roulette. Here I go. Hmm. Is that hollow sound his head or the egg? Ashley's turn. Get that ice ready. Phew. So far, so good. Looks like Natalie got lucky, but we're running out of eggs. Let's see if Ben can escape his fate. Mm. Go for it, Ashley. Maybe you'll finally be first at something. Ah, oh, thank God, I'm still in the game. 
All right, Ben, it's all up to you. Oh, man, 50-50 chance. Ugh. Well, at least it wasn't my beautiful head that cracked. And now for some bloopers. Hit that subscribe button and keep those pranks a-going. See you next time.